Hey guys, Brendan Productions here, and welcome to my eighth Java tutorial. And uh, this tutorial is actually going to be on how to create random numbers using the java.util.random library. So, I've already created a uh, project class here. Alright, just a class that we're going to be using for this tutorial. And uh, I've entitled it Random Tutorial uh, for obvious reasons. But anyway, um, so the first thing we need to do in actually creating a random number is import the random library which is java.util.random with a capital R and this uh, library actually lets us generate random numbers just comment that really fast now um, now what we need to do is actually declare a class section so we're going to say public class and this is random tutorial um, and now we need to create a main which uh, runs all Java applications. So public static void main string args, and then we need to open curly brackets to actually code our section. So the first thing we need to do in order to create a random number is actually create an instance of the Java Java .util .random library, uh, which can actually be done just like if you're creating a variable. So you want to type in random, which is the type of the variable, and then a name for the variable, so we're going to call it rnd, equal to new. Uh, so this is creating a new instance of what uh, it's going to be random. So we're going to open and close those parentheses, and then semicolon. This is just saying that we're sending no parameters over. And now, since creating a random number is relatively easy, we can actually... Uh, generate the random number with one more line and we will actually want this number to be displayed to the console um, so we're just going to type system dot out dot print line and then in this uh, specific parameter here what we want to print we're just going to type in rnd dot next int which gets the next random integer from this random variable and uh, then we can open up parentheses and send out another parameter. Now by default it just gets some random integer um, like across the board. It could be 1, it could be 8,200. But um, right here we can actually specify the max value. So we can say generate a random number from 0 to 100 by typing in 100 here. And then we just want to type in a semicolon to end the statement and we should be good. So now, if we run this uh, actual project itself, we'll get a random number outputted from 0 to 100. Press OK there, and uh, as you can see, the console says 7. But if we run it again, we get 87, and we can keep running it to get random numbers between uh, 0 and 100. And uh, that's how you generate random numbers in Java. Uh, so thanks for watching this tutorial on how to use the java.util.random library. This can come in very useful if you're creating uh, things like games, uh, such as card games, or even little role-playing games, where you need to generate a random number for what attack value a certain thing does. Um, yeah. So thanks for watching this tutorial. Remember to rate, comment, subscribe, and um, please leave a comment. Really, It really does help. And that's all I really have to say. Have a good day, guys. Uh, talk to you later.